everybody and today I'm gonna to be talking to you guys about the peacekeeper I thought I would show you guys the stats so you can see what it looks like on paper for anyone that doesn't have it Generally the peacekeeper has a higher accuracy and a higher range than the other SMGs But it has a lower fire rate and a lower damage than the other SMGs So I'm just comparing here so you can see the difference between the peacekeeper and the other SMGs and Yeah, let's go ahead and get into some gameplay so the Peacekeeper is basically what I said it was going to be in my Peacekeeper premonition video, if you can call it that. If you did miss that video, I will leave the link in the description. Also, I did do a review on the DLC map separately from a look at the Peacekeeper. So if you did miss that, I will also leave that in the description. But in that video, I basically said that I feel it's going to be okay as an assault rifle and okay as an SMG. And that's pretty much what it is. It has a much better range than other SMGs, so it can compete at a further range than the average SMG, but it's not as good up close as regular SMGs. Now, it's kind of hard to tell this if you're playing with the DLC installed or the DLC playlist, because right now, 99% of people are using the Peacekeeper. So when you're going up against people at a range or at close range, they're using a the Peacekeeper. So it's kind of hard to say which one is better than the other but I was running around with a, a regular SMG I was using the PDW when everyone was using the Peacekeeper and up close it's it has a disadvantage it definitely has a disadvantage I noticed that I could kill people with the Peacekeeper up close pretty damn easily now I don't know what it's like to take out a Peacekeeper guy at long distance with an assault rifle but I have been owned by assault rifles at a distance using the Peacekeeper so yeah it's it's better at range than an SMG and it's better up close than an assault rifle that's pretty much the best explanation I can give of it now getting down to kind of how it handles the run speed when you're running with the Peacekeeper you run at the same speed as using an assault rifle now, it's kind of weird because in the description, it's like, oh, you have the speed and mobility of an SMG, but the range and blah, blah, of an assault rifle. That's kind of not really very true. Because if you look at the character models of people running with the Peacekeeper, they run with it the exact same way as they do with an assault rifle. And when you go from using an SMG to the Peacekeeper, you can tell that you're definitely slower than you were. So running is definitely slower than a regular SMG. It's the same speed as an assault rifle. But when you are ADSing, aiming down sights, for people that don't know, you do move at the same speed as an SMG. So that's kind of weird. You run like an assault rifle, but you ADS like an SMG. Now, in terms of recoil, when you first shoot the Peacekeeper, the first three or so shots will point the gun up. It will bounce up. But after that, it is very, very easy to manage. There's little to no recoil after that. So that is really good. It's a really good gun. It is a good gun, but I am personally sick of using it just because I'm tired of being slow. I'm tired of being a fat guy on the battlefield. But don't get me wrong, Peacekeeper is a very viable gun. It does exactly what it says it does, and I think that they did a very good job at balancing it. I don't see why anyone would be mad at the Peacekeeper because it is beatable by everything in the game. It just gives you a wider variety of playstyles when you're using it. That's it. So speaking of playstyles, the playstyle that you have when using the Peacekeeper, now for me, this is me personally, guys. This is my opinion and how I felt when I was using the gun. So you might have a totally different experience. But for me personally, I felt like I had to be slightly more careful and slightly slower than using one of the other SMGs. Now that's just because my run speed is a lot slower so I feel like if I get into a st sticky situation I can't run away as easily so I was a little bit more careful but I wasn't as careful as I would be with an assault rifle so there's definitely a difference between the playstyle with the peacekeeper and with a regular SMG but it's not nearly as different as that of an assault rifle and an SMG so I actually think it's a really good gun if you're transitioning from assault rifles to SMGs or SMGs to assault rifles because you have to, ch well you don't have to, but ideally you should change your playstyle slightly to get the most out of the gun but it's not so much of a change that you're completely out of your comfort zone. So all in all, the Peacekeeper is a very good gun. It does exactly what it says it's gonna do so if that's the kind of gun you want, that's what you get. Also, it's very easy to get headshots with it, which is a plus. I already have it gold without even going for gold. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Bye.